Welcome, Virgos. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. This is a quantum healing business reading. It is the on the deal of catticon.com. All right. I see self forgiveness is coming up, Virgos. Whatever you have done, I see self forgiveness. Some of you, Virgos, um, could have to make some sort of a decision that has uh, created some problems for this king of uh, cups. Okay. So I see self forgiveness. I see that some of you, Virgos, is just definitely standing your grounds and, uh, is, uh, um, working on yourself. So whatever is happening, thank you, thank you, thank you. So whatever is happening, Virgos, you are just standing your grounds, okay? And uh, um, you made some sort of a decision that is affecting the King of Cups, but I think you had to make a call. You made a call in order to protect yourself and protect other people um, in your corporate institution or in your business okay so some of you could have been dealing with a pisces cancer or a scorpion whether this person is and whatever is transpiring let's look first at what sort of energy is coming up we see six five one some sort of information is coming out about um the um a leo some of you are dealing with a Leo in this situation and you are going to be receiving help against this Leo and what this Leo has done, okay? So it's as if you Virgos in a corporation institution, a Leo has done some sort of an injustice and you stood your ground. Um, This energy of six is about materialistic wealth and you Virgos are going to be um, financially stable. I see help is going to be coming in for you, Virgos. I see that some sort of a decision you, Virgos, are going to be doing is going to be leaving a Pisces, a Cancer, or a Scorpion man in some sort of a hardship. It is his problem. Whatever that he has created, he has to um, answer to whatever he has created. So I see that you, Virgos, have to make some sort of a decision that is going to be affecting a, a Pisces Cancer and a Scorpion man, whoever this man is, and whatever the decision that you have to make, uh, it is his karma, okay? So I see you, Virgos, are forgiving yourself, forgiving yourself for something that has happened and has transpired. You're forgiving yourself, and you need to let go of this guilt, okay? So you, Virgos, are holding on on some form of a guilt, because of some decision you had to make. It is what it is, Virgos. And you can't, um, being a manager and being um, in work and business and career, you have to make some sort of a decision. So you could be a professor. You could be someone who's writing a reference. You could be someone who is uh, um, dealing with uh, reconstruction of a corporation institution. However, and whatever this is, uh, I see you, Virgos, are definitely... Um, definitely having some sort of regrets. It is a period of materialistic wealth. Okay, the energy of the six is mastering some sort of a business, being good at what you're doing. Okay, and um, you're going to be okay. I see um, people are going to be appreciating you, Virgos, for what you're doing. I see a Taurus is going to be having some sort of a problem. I see um, the decision that you make, you Virgos, is going to be affecting a Taurus and a Pisces Cancer or a Scorpion. And whoever this Pisces Cancer or a Scorpion is, is going to be coming in a lot of hardship because of some sort of a decision that you Virgos do. But it's his problem because he has created this karma for himself and uh, um, it has to be resolved. I see some sort of inf information. I see you Virgos are going to be taking down a Leo. Whoever this Leo is and whatever is transpiring, I see you Virgos are standing your ground and is going to be taking down a Leo. Some of you um, is working together against a Leo. So some of you Virgos together with a Taurus could be working together, uh, uh, working together against a Leo because of some sort of a situation. So this... Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion Man could have brought in a Leo in a corporation institution. And this is um, someone who um, created some sort of an issue because what you're seeing here, it is a mixture of masculine energy, masculine and feminine energy. And I see you, Virgus, is working from out of the masculine energy and you're standing your ground. And I see 
whoever that is working with some sort of a complex, you are going to be ending this complex. And I see people are going to be appreciating and understanding and it's going to be offering you some sort of a help because you have resolved some sort of an issue, okay? There was some sort of an issue that was going on and people are going to be seeing this, that you stood up um, stood up against a young uh, Leo that has created some sort of an issue. Whoever this Leo is, is connected to this person, okay? And I see whatever is transpiring, you Virgos are seeing what this young Leo has done. So obviously, a lot of you are dealing with a fire sign person and it's coming up as a Leo. And you have to be abreast and on top of your games. And I see you Virgo stood up against this person and said, no, this is not the person. This is who this person is saying they are. No, it's not true. And I see it brings this man, this businessman or this boss in some sort of a hardship and it is their problem. I see a Taurus is helping you Virgos to get out of a situation that this man has created. This man is an old boss. This man is um a boss and I see no good news is coming in for this man. It's as if they're realizing that this man has, has created um this problem and I see no victory is coming in for a Pisces Cancer or a Scorpion person because they realize um, you realize that this man was uh, already knowing what was transpiring in the work floor or on the work floor or in a business situation that was transpiring and they're realizing and seeing the truth. I see um, um, you Virgos are going to be offered some sort of a support getting out of a situation and a Taurus might come in and help you Virgos because this Taurus has, has also gotten involved in this situation and this Taurus is realizing that this Leo is very very um you know playing this Leo has played some sort of a game um that is uh, some sort of a um dishonest game in order to get some sort get in some sort of a um, corporation institution and they're going to be finding out what this Leo has uh, done. So a lot of you are dealing with some sort of a conflicts, conflicts that have to do with a Leo um, and you are standing your grounds because I see you Virgo said, no, this is not the person. This Leo is not the person. This Leo is not speaking the truth. So as we look at your stability, your stability is that you're ending some sort of a conflict so with a fire sign person, an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius. And I see you're going to be receiving some help to remove this person um, because this person had lied and created some sort of an issue. And I see you're going to be coming in and removing this person. And you need to just forgive yourself, but it, it is a karmatic situation. However, it is transpiring. It is a karmatic situation, okay? So your stability here is very good because you're going to be get, receiving some sort of a help from a Taurus to end a conflict and to remove a fire sign person and you're going to be getting some sort of a help to push you forward so i see um you're going to be moving forward virgos because they're going to be seeing what this fire sign person has done and you're going to be pushing forward out of some sort of a hardship that has come up so um some of you virgos are was waiting um, and some of you Virgos in the month of October. So check out the reading of October. In the month of October, some sort of a news is going to be coming in about a Pisces Cancer or a Scorpion man. This man is a businessman or this man is a boss. This man could be a supervisor. You could be receiving some hard news from this man or over this man. It is no good news that is going to be coming in in October about this man. Whoever this man is, a Virgo, in October, check out the um, October reading. Go and look at the bi-monthlies that is showing up. The two first week, the last section, is showing up the two first week 
in October that is going to be telling you something about this man. Some news that you're going to be finding out about this man is not very good, Virgos. You're going to be very, very surprised. And because of this news, you are going to be making some sort of a decision. And it's about forgiving yourself for making this decision. As we look in November, we see people are appreciating you, Virgos, for what you have done. Um, it's as if you, Virgos, really stood up and help out a situation and release some sort of an issue and situation that was going on. You Virgos really stand your place and I see people are going to be awarding you and really um, happy that you Virgos as stand to help them out of some sort of a hardship and situation that they were dealing with where it could have been a boss that was creating some sort of an issue or a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio man who was creating some sort of an issue um, and placing people in some sort of a hardship. And you are going to be standing up and um, supporting these people and helping these people to get out of whatever the hardship is and getting out. So um, you are going to be pleasantly offered something because you Virgo stood up for a cause and this is going to be good okay um and you're going to be you Virgos are going to be also helping out a Taurus in order to get out of some sort of a situation that a Pisces Cancer and Scorpion have placed you both in okay it could be you both or you're helping this person to get out of this hardship so I see a Virgo is going to be really um um giving you a hand um, and releasing you out of some sort of a hardship. Um, it could be offering you a, a, a job, offering you a position, getting you out from a department, putting you in another department, sending you to another place to work, that sort of a thing. But I see, um, really, um, someone and help, some help is going to be coming in to help you out. You could be also helping out other people and removing and handing some sort of a conflict. Now, December, December is the month where you're really ending the conflicts. It's as if you Virgos decided this is the last of this. I'm putting a stop to this. This has to be ended because I'm not moving forward in a new year with this problem around me. And I see you Virgos are going to be receiving help in order to end a conflict, a conflict in situation that has been going on for um, uh, the most seven years, okay? Um, it could be uh, some sort of a situation that has followed you, followed you to every job and you are now really standing up and saying, no, no more. I am not dealing with this. I'm ending this in the month of December. I'm leaving this behind. And I see as you ask the universe for help, I see help is going to be coming in to the you from the universe to you is as if you're like Jesus I can't take this more this has to stop I can't move into another year with this problem that is going on and I see you ask for help to resolve some sort of a conflicts and issue and situation and you are going to be receiving this help so whatever is transpiring Virgos whoever was trying to stop you block you um not letting you move forward it is as if the universe is saying no, um, you are moving forward no matter what people are creating around you. You are going to be standing your grounds. You are going to be showing up for yourself, standing your grounds and understanding that life is about moving forward. Whatever is happening, whatever is transpiring, it's about moving forward and not letting anyone blocking you from you accepting your power and, um, and standing up against people who have been just walking over you on the work floor and that sort of a thing. You are getting people out of hardships. You are um, using your power or using your gifts in order to help people to get out. So whatever the conflicts is, because a whole lot of you, be careful of uh, a Leo, a whole lot of you is going to be having some sort of a conflict. And I see a Leo is going to be coming up um, to ask you guys for help. And I see you're not... Uh, um, open to help this Leo because you realize that this Leo has been very dishonest and you're like, you know, it is better. Um, no, I, I see you're going to just decide it and said, no, uh, uh, I don't know anything about this. I do not want to be involved. And I see you're going to be slowly removing yourself away from a Leo because you realize that this person or this 
situation that this Leo is connected with. Uh, this Leo has been creating a whole lot of issues for other people that bring you in some sort of a situation. So um, it's going to be a quartal. It's going to be a quartal, ladies and gentlemen. Remember, these are timeless reading. Whenever you pick it up, this is a time that you should have it. Please remember to subscribe, thumbs up, um, in order for these reading to um, go through um, the um, the Google that Google can pick them up. It is going to be a quarter layer. You gotta be old on if you want to see the extended of this reading. You can follow me um, to the other side. If not, I love you guys so much. Um, three of these readings are. Um, uh, yeah, three of these readings is 15% off. You pay less than $5. So it is good to see what is coming up. The buy readings are out and I will advise you Virgos to go and look at the buy readings because the buy readings is going to be telling you something about the Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion man, the news that you're going to be receiving some sort of a news from about this man, a Pisces, Cancer, a Scorpion man, and it's going to be telling you something that you were not aware of. I got to go. I'm saying namaste. Please thumbs up these videos. Love you guys. Namaste. Mm -hmm.